Hi guys, welcome to another video. In this video, we are going to discuss about Beyond Compare tool. Basically, Beyond Compare is used to compare file and folders in a wide range. Though there are a lot of higher versions are available, still we can make lower versions as useful. It is free and easy to download. Only two options. Either you can go for file comparison or folder comparison. No complex culture, simple to use. If you are a beginner, definitely you should look into this tool and it will be helpful and solve your problems. Let's get started. Hi guys, I have installed Beyond Compare tool as you can notice from my screen. Double clicking. So you can see the Beyond Compare screen now. Help menu about Beyond Compare. And you can see version 2.5.3. I have 28 uh, days remaining for the evaluation. And I can extend it further. And below is the copyright uh, information details. So going back to session menu and choosing open menu item, and you can find this uh, open dialog. Here you have two options either you can choose files or folders. And below also you have a new folder comparison option and new file comparison options. When I click on a uh, new file comparison, then you can notice the reader button is automatically shifted to files. Similarly, for new uh, folder comparison, the radio button automatically shifted to folders option. And in the right hand side, you can see left file and right file, and you have the option to choose left file and right file. Now I am choosing left file as student management and right file as student management difference. Here uh, this one is the left pen and this one is the right pen. And for left we have selected uh, student management or CPP and right I have selected student management difference or CPP. And this is the toolbar and in toolbar you can see uh, different icons. So you, here you can see one down arrow and up arrow. So down arrow is for the next difference and up arrow is for previous difference. If I click on down arrow, so it will be moving to the next difference channel. Finally, the message has been prompted and it is saying next difference is not found. Similarly, if I will be clicking this icon, then it will be going back. Uh, I mean previous changes. And finally, in the message previous difference not found. Now we are seeing a side by side view layout. If you wanted to see over and under layout, just click on this icon. So it will be showing over and under layout. Similarly, you can uh, go for next and previous difference like this. If you wanted to see only the differences, not entire source code, then you just select on this icon. It will show just differences. That means you can see the differences between two files. So here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, that means only 6 differences are there between the left and right files. Similarly, if you wanted to see the line numbers against each uh, line, then you select 1, 2, 3 icon. So it will display all the line numbers here. So if you click next, next, see now the line number is 72. Next, now the next change is 426. Next, now the next change is uh, 471. In this way, you can better track your differences. Similarly, if you wanted to see on the line details and all, just click on this icon. If I click, then you can see the line details. Next, you can see next line details. So here the difference is uh, first line contains CH and second line CHIR. So that is the only difference. Similarly, in our next line, see here, uh, student menu and here, ratio. So here you can easily identify uh, by knowing the line details. Similarly, if you wanted to see the spacing and all or gaps, so you have to select a tilde sign. So here you can see. And sometimes you know, and the spacing handle cause very big problem. So you better need to format and identify the spaces. I mean extra spaces handle. So here, here you can see uh, uh, all the means copy, paste, source, all options are there. So you can utilize those options as per your need. And similarly, you can see one arrow is pointing to right. And this arrow is for copy. 
from one side to other side right suppose uh, so now the arrow is pointing to right that means i can copy this line to this line and from left to right similarly if i will be uh, select this line the arrow is automatically reverted and it is pointing to left that means from right to left i can copy so as your need you can copy from left to right or right to left if you want to swap the sides i mean left side to right side and right side to left side then you can go to file menu and select swap sides so it will automatically swap so if you want to exit so you can exit from here or you can use escape button from the keyboard if you are not to save the files you can use save or save as options from here so if you want to see the comparison info then you can click a comparison info here it will show uh, 483 lines are matching and six lines are different and if you want to uh, generate file difference report and then you can see and uh, as we selected side by side and output options are there printer html or plain text so here you can directly print uh, you can see the print preview and print option here let's discuss about uh, folder comparison so go to session menu and click on open so we have to select folder option here and we have to select uh, left folder so i am uh, selecting the left folder as backup folder and then right folder as uh, current folder so here you can see each folder contains four files out of four files two files are mismatching and two files are matching and uh, you can notice here one equals uh, symbol i mean icon if you click here it will show all matching files and two files are matching so it will show matching files and if you hit this icon then it will show all mismatching files even you can double confirm by double clicking uh, so here you can see the differences similarly if you double click so see the differences here and star icon if you click it will show all files i mean mismatching and matching files this option is used for the expanding and uh, collapsing so if uh, folders inside folders i mean soft folders are there then better we can use those options there if you wanted to sync i mean from left to right we have to use this icon so it will show copy to files all mismatched files will be copied or synced to the right side so similarly if you want to uh, go back to I means so one level up we have to use those things things and if you want to take a snapshot so you have to uh, click on this icon so if you want to take the left hand side or right hand side or from other then we have to select and we have to start it so that's all that's a very simple tool and very easy to use also